G'day, I'm Rod McKenzie. And I'm Glenn Casey. And we're up the river doing a spot of fishing. And what we'd like to do is a little bit of a demo on our ideas on catch and release, how quick, simple and effective it really is. So if you just bear with us, we'll have a bit of a cast around and uh, we'll see if we can't catch a fish and let him go in the best condition we can possibly let him go in. As you can see, we've got our net up the front. All our gear here for catch and release, pliers, gloves. Uh, yeah, he's ready, mate. So forth and so on. Now, normally, a wet towel on the deck or something like that, but because the weather's cooler and this, this net will fill up fairly well with water, we'll just bring the fish in. Just lead him in. Doesn't want to hop in. There we go, drop the rod tip. Now, <coughs> there's no rush to lift the fish into the boat. You can sort of leave him sitting in the net like that. Make sure all your stuff's organised. Like I said, we've got bolt cutters for if they're deep hooked. We've got pliers just for pulling hooks and stuff out. And we've got a, a glove to handle it. If you want to have a measuring mat here, have it all laid out and ready to go. Now, Glenn, while that fish is in the net, I'll get you to open that camera case for me. Yes, mate. Grab the camera. And this is all time saved. It's, it's, it's all important to have everything ready to rock and roll. Right, I will bring him in, mate. Okay. I'll just seat the camera there. Oh, no. Are we ready to go? Yep. Grab a side, mate. Yeah. In we go. Oh. Look at the size of him. Beautiful fish. Now we've got our pliers here. He's not hooked down deep. So we should be able to just get a hold of that hook in there. And give it a little twist out. Put your glove on, Glenn. Just one second, mate. We'll just pull this lure and that out of the road. Beautiful. Put your glove on, mate. Everything's ready to go. I'll get myself in camera position. Got him, mate. Yes. Now it's important to support the fish's weight, the full weight of the fish like that. Try and keep it off your body if you can. It's not always possible because some fish are a lot bigger than others. Down a little bit, mate. Happy snap. Happy snap. Just check your lens, mate. Mm, got a bit of yuck on there. One more. Happy snap. Lowering back in, mate. So you're not too big. Just lower them back in, get over the side. And just gently sit them back down in the water. Just hold him for a second. And away they go. Just beautiful. And that's, and that's pretty much it. It's uh, fairly simple. It's all about saving time, looking after the fish. And that's a pretty simple procedure. We have our net sits on the nose of the boat here, ready to go. Our cutters, pliers and glove up here in the corner, ready to go. The camera will now go back in the box and hopefully we'll repeat that procedure again and again as the day goes on so as i said if it's a bit warmer a wet towel on the deck or even tip some water on the deck so the fish aren't laying on anything hot um, otherwise at this time of the year the actual bottom of the net carries enough it's water nice and to keep the cool yeah so and the rest of it don't roar up and down the river showing your mates your fish show them your photo yeah awesome thanks guys